I'm Stephen Birch and this is Seahopper. The British Marine Southampton Boat Show 2020 has been sadly cancelled, as you know, because of COVID. So I thought we'd have our own boat show right here in Devon, where we make these classic, iconic folding boats. So welcome to uh, our viewers from Europe, from North America, from Canada, from Australia and New Zealand, and of course from the UK, folk who've been sadly disappointed by the cancellation. Okay, uh, come on in. Since 1974, nearly 8,000 of these boats have been built and sailed around the world. And in the next few minutes, I want to get across to you the appeal, the lasting appeal of sea hoppers. There's yacht tenders, there's fishing boats, there's dinghies for family cruising, or simply for messing around in boats. Okay, the first one, the first boat, the smallest in the fleet, is the Scamp, just over two meters, or six foot six, and incredibly easy to uh, put together. Made of elite marine ply and built to order, these boats can be easily assembled in very little time. And I'm just going to demonstrate that. Imagine you've driven down from the city to the beach or the slipway, you've lifted the boat off the roof rack, and here we go. Okay, that's the main part of the construction. The rest just gives the boat its final shape. So there we are, voila, that's it says. That's all there is to it. Oh, except for just add a pair of lovely oars. So we have a fantastic little rowing dinghy. And finally, what about an outboard bracket onto which you clip your petrol or electric outboard to make a great little motorboat? So that's the scamp. Let's move over now to look at the lighter. This is the mid-range boat at 2.4 meters or 7 foot 10 with a lovely balanced unstayed lug rig which is so easy to assemble. This boat's been customized. It's also got this spray hood to match the color of the uh, bow and stern panel. It also has this lovely rope fender, a very practical addition particularly for coming alongside and then the other sailing bits and pieces, such as the dagger board, the side seats, and this classic dinghy rudder and tiller. The yachting press loves sea hoppers, and the lighter made the final in this year's 2020 Classic Boat Awards. So that's the lighter, and now we're going to see the Condor which is the flagship of the fleet at three meters or 10 feet. Okay, this is the uh, Condor. You'll see rigged with the high aspect Gunter rig and the other sailing bits and pieces, dagger board, side seats, uh, buoyancy bag, um, tiller extension. And on this particular boat, note also we fitted what we call a dual purpose outboard bracket which means you can clip on an outboard alongside the rudder so that after a long day sail, you can motor back safely to the uh, shore. Oh, and by the way, this boat also has uh, this little contraption, which we call the sand wheels. And the idea of this is to create a trolley that allows you to transport the boat over rough terrain or indeed down a sandy beach, particularly when the tide is out. Great little innovation. Simply slips 
um, into the Dagobah box from uh, beneath the boat. So those are the sandwiches. Okay, that's our quick little uh, trip around. Um, when you buy a sea hopper, you'll stand out from the crowd. These boats are easy on the earth, made from sustainable resources, and they will last and serve your generation and the next generation. That's the appeal of Seahawk. Thanks for listening.